Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm your entrepreneurship tutor, Professor Henry Buisa of Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology in Kenya. Now, at that link, that link, I covered this startup process. I covered the seven steps, or rather introduced the seven steps of starting a business. Today, I want to talk about step one, the self-assessment. Before you start a business, test your entrepreneurial readiness. Ask yourself, am I ready? Do I have what it takes? Now, this is a self-assessment. It means critically analyzing your own goals, interests, skills, and experience. This can help you recognize areas where you will need assistance or training before you start your business. This is not a pass or fail test. It will only guide you to identify the entrepreneurial qualities that you have and those that you don't have. You can then build on those that you have and develop those that you don't have. To be successful in this self-assessment, be honest with yourself. Read the given statements and score yourself immediately. Thinking over them for long may mean that you are debating with yourself and may reduce the accuracy of the answer. Your impulsive or immediate response better represents your inner self. So, score yourself as soon as you finish reading an item. Now, for every item, score yourself 5 if you strongly agree with it, 4 if you just agree with it, 3 if you do not, or rather, if you are not very sure about it, 2 if you disagree with it, and 1 if you strongly disagree with it. Now, I want to say that this tool was not developed by myself. I've, I adapted it from the Entrepreneurship Literature Review. So it is something that has been used elsewhere. As I said, the following statements, score five if you strongly agree, four if you agree, three if you somehow agree, two if you disagree, and one if you strongly agree. Let's go. Statement number one, I am willing to work eight hours or more per day regularly. If you strongly agree, score 5. If you just agree, score 4. If you somehow agree, score 3. If you disagree, score 2. If you strongly disagree, score 1. Please, don't score all of them 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 on one item. Choose which you uh, represents you. Number 2. My family will support my going into business. Score it. Three, I will accept both financial and other risks when necessary. Score it. Four, in wage employment, I do not need fringe benefits. Score it. Five, I, I do take full responsibility for my actions. Score it. I think self-employment is more rewarding. Score it. I feel very proud when I complete a project successfully. Score it. I can maintain energy over a long time. Score it. I enjoy making decisions and controlling my own <coughs> work. Sorry. Score it. I believe I am solely responsible for my success and failure. Score it. Now you have scored every item on this page. Total them up. The score that you have achieved and then move on to the next set of items. 11. I crave for positive results even when it requires great effort. Score it. 12. I have good a good understanding of how to manage a business. Score it. I can survive in ambiguous situations. Score it. One or both of my parents were or are entrepreneurs. Score it. I believe I have better abilities and skills than most of my co-workers. Score it. P. 
people trust me and consider me honest and reliable, score it. I never abandon a project regardless of obstacles and difficulties, score it. I will do something even when others laugh or belittle me for it, score it. I can make decisions quickly, score it. I have a good network of people and the business acquaintances, score it. Now, total this score on this page too and add the previous score to this score to get the grand score. So you total all the 20 items and get your grand score. Now, interpretation of your score. Your score lies within these bands. 80 to 100, 60 to 79, 40 to 59, 0 to 39. Now, to facilitate us, send you an explained interpretation of your score. Please send us only $2 or 200 Kenya shillings. You will get the interpretation of these bands for you to know yourself. You will further get explanations of the entrepreneurial qualities associated with the statements in the self-assessment drill and how these qualities can be developed. You will therefore discover your strong and weak entrepreneurial qualities and how you can improve on your weak qualities. So, send the payment to Lipana Mpesa by Good Steel number 5476465. But you can also send to Cooperative Bank of Kenya, Zimmerman Branch, account number 011094288099900. The name will be Henry Buisa. Send us the evidence that you have paid in together with your email or WhatsApp number, and we shall send you the package. Now, in the next talks, we shall cover steps two and step three on methods of generating business ideas and the methods of assessing the generated business ideas for their feasibility and viability. Thank you for listening, and I hope you'll undertake or take this self-assessment.